talk about the role of communication in managing diverse global staffs. Oftentimes there are businesses where half their staff is not in the building, let alone in the, in the city state, they're across the world. Yes. And uh, how do you manage that form of communication? Well, again, everybody can only worry about their best communication ever. And if they've been communicating in some dysfunctional manner, that is going to offend. However, those people have got to learn what the communication style is of the teammates that they're talking to across the world. I have, I am blessed with a private clientele from around the world who communicate with me uh, for whom I do coaching from countries that I never even think about. And what I have learned from them, again, is that we all have the same issues. We all have the same needs. We all want the same things. And whether it's somebody in Belgium, or Honduras, or California, or Germany, it doesn't make a difference because if I am supporting your needs because I have taken the time and effort to get to know you better, then that person feels wonderful. It always seems to revolve around that one item. Do you have my back? And every single relationship we are in necessitates our friends and lovers, and teammates, and everybody we work with to have our back, some more than others. But we want to know that we can feel safe in our environment. And these days, safety is of utmost importance. Yeah. It's interesting how I came upon this in the midst of all our needs for safety.